I'm Dr. Roger, and this question is from the March 2021 U.S. SAT non-calculator section. College Board is essentially asking us to convert units, convert a combination of Groshen and Fennigs to all Fennigs, where each Groshen co coin is worth 10 Fennigs. And one way to approach this is to make up numbers that work. If I have, let's say, five Fennigs, I need 80 more in value from Groshen, and each is worth 10. So eight Groshen would be worth 80 Fennigs, plus the five individual Fennigs is 85. So this combination works. If I try this combination in choice A, 5 plus 8 is 13, which is not 85. That does not match the equation, so the equation for A cannot be my correct equation. If I try this in B, 5 plus 8 times 10 is 5 plus 80 equals 85. That does work. In choice C, 5 times 10 is 50, plus 8 is 58. That does not work, so this is not the correct answer. And in choice D, 5 plus 8 is 13. 10 times 13 is 130, which is not 85. The correct equation has to work for all combinations of Groshen and Fennig coins that add up to 85 Fennigs. And choice B is the only one that works for this combination of coins. So choice B is the correct answer. Come back soon for my next SAT video. With math, there's always more.